News, information just arrived straight from the Detroit Red Wings arena, what's next for Larkin? If you want to stay on top of all the Red Wings news, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss the latest first-hand news. The future of Dylan Larkin Fans like to debate whether Dylan Larkin is a uh, true number one center. His stats say yes, Larkin was 17th among NHL centers with 79 points and 18th in assists this season. His 32 goals are one short of Sidney Crosby's tally and two short of Steven Stamkos' tally. General Manager Steve Eisenman believed in Dylan Larkin enough to give him a new contract worth $8.7 million a season, though it took a while to get there. Larkin tied his career high with 32 goals and set a new personal high of 79 points. He is undeniably a popular captain. This is what coach Derek Lalonde said about Larkin at the end of the season. All year he's been fighting, playing the game right. I'm not surprised it's a career year for him, but I think with the little things in his game, him managing the puck, him limiting turnovers, the way he's been in zone D, the improvement in zone D, we're asking him to play in the top four from the penalty spot, he's doing a lot of really good things and I'm happy he's being rewarded with a career year. Leave your like on this video so you don't miss the latest Red Wings news firsthand. Larkin recorded a 7-point streak from February 7th to 18th. He scored 6 goals and 7 assists in that span. In that streak, he had a 4-game stretch when he added 10 points. 8 times Larkin has recorded 3 points in a game this season. The Detroit Red Wings wanted more from Larkin this season. They wanted him to be more responsible away from the puck and they wanted him to be more error-free when he's controlling the puck. Lalonde will point out plays he doesn't like in the name of turning them into a teachable moment. Larkin is not spared these moments. Yes, there were some uncomfortable moments in the video, Larkin said. That's part of being a leader and part of being a top player. It's meaningful when you're there and you're called on because we're all in this together and we all have to defend together and improve together. There were some uncomfortable clips, but I think it helps the group. Larkin grew as a player and leader. Lalonde has said more than once that the team's offense flows through Larkin. Everyone accepts that Larkin cares deeply about his team, teammates, and their level of performance. And everyone knows Larkin will be an even better player when the Red Wings are deeper in offensive talent. Hey Red Wings fans, in your opinion, what do you expect from Larkin for next season? Put your opinion in the comments, because your comment is very important for the Red Wings. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, because at any time I will give you more information exclusively.